Hello everyone, today I am going to tell you how to find out the roots of a polynomial. But uh, in case, for example, x is equal to 0, then the root will be 0. If x square is equal to 0, but the roots will be 0, comma 0. If x cube is equal to 0, then the roots will be 0, 0, 0. Similarly, x minus 1 whole square is equal to 0, that means x is equal to 1 and 1, 1 comma 1. But sometimes uh, the students are writing uh, simply 1. If x minus 1 whole cube is equal to 0, then they are writing x is equal to 1. No, this is a cubic equation, so answer will be 1, 1, 1. So, in the silo also, you will get the answer like this. And actually, we know the number of roots will be equal to the degree of the polynomial. If the degree is third degree, then you will get three roots. If the degree uh, is fourth degree polynomial, then you will get four roots. And similar, let us say. So, our aim is to find out the roots of a polynomial. To find the roots of a polynomial. Okay, so we have to take the polynomial first, p is equal to, I am uh, taking the polynomial as p, p is equal to, and the coding is poly, then start a bracket, then again square bracket, in which you should write the coefficients, and uh, for example, I am writing uh, 1 space, uh, minus 2 space 1 then close the bracket then comma we have to write the variable within double inverted comma then put a comma then now uh, what are the numbers 1 minus 2 1 they are the coefficients of the polynomial so within inverted comma we should write coefficient c o e f f then inverted comma close then close the bracket then enter so this is the polynomial and if you want to find out the roots, actually uh, roots means what are the values of x we should put so that the polynomial will become 0. Those are the roots. So that means 1 minus 2x plus x square equal to 0. You will take uh, this one equal to p is equal to 0. Then you will get the roots of the equation. Okay. So actually I have written x minus 1 whole square. x square minus 2x plus 1. It is x minus 1 whole square. So let us see what are the roots roots of the polynomial p okay just uh, enter so see here we are getting 1 1 so anything we can get the real roots or complex roots also let us take uh, randomly another polynomial q is equal to p o l y poly we'll put a square bracket 1 right i'm taking it randomly and uh, close the bracket comma um, then I am taking the variable as y, comma, c o e f f. Then close the bracket and enter. So roots of q. So let us see. See here, this is in the form of complex. Cubic equation. Cubic equation means so uh, one will be real and the two are complex. See here, one, 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 this one is zero and the other two are complex conjugates. A plus IB, another is A minus IB. So likewise, you can get the roots of a polynomial. First of all, we should write the polynomial, then write uh, the coding as roots of the polynomial P. Op means bracket. So, within the bracket, we should write the polynomial whose roots are required. Okay. So, in this row, you can find out the roots of a polynomial. So, now you can do some of the problems. Okay. And uh, in my next video, I will tell you some more uh, program on polynomials. Okay. Till then, bye-bye.